I am Mrs. Hughes. I've been married a long time. I've been married so long that my oldest daughter's my age. I didn't mean to be married this long. No, I just stuck around the last 10 years pretty much to piss him off. <laughs> Who thought till death do us part was gonna take this long? <laughs> People ask me all the time, what's the secret to a long and happy marriage? I can tell you the secret to a long one. <laughs> Children. That's the reason my husband and I are together today is the kids. Neither of us wanted custody. <laughs> if any of you out there are planning on having children, take my advice and have natural childbirth. Save that anesthesia till that kid's a teenager and you're really... <laughs> My son Scooter was the sweetest child on the planet. Ten years old, we're at dinner one night, and he goes, Mama, when I get married, I want to marry someone exactly like you. Then out of the corner of my eye, I saw my husband go. <laughs> one minute, Scooter's ten years old and the sweetest child. The next thing you know, like that, he's 15 and he's got an attitude. We'd been fighting all day and he came over to me and he goes, So, why'd you have me? <laughs> well, actually, we didn't know it'd be you. for someone with a job. <laughs> well, he's all grown up now. He's in love and he wants to get married. Do you think she's anything like me? <laughs> the first time I met Hiawatha, she had a safety pin through her eye. <laughs> I didn't even know your eyebrow could fall off. <laughs> eight minutes. <laughs> Neither one of these kids are the sharpest cheese on the cracker. She thinks fiance and finance are spelled the same. <laughs> he thinks God's name is Howard. <laughs> Our Father who art in heaven, Howard, be thy name. <laughs> It's my fault when he was growing up, I said to him, don't get smart. <laughs> now he's grown and he's not. 